Hi guys, another item out of that bag of toys that I bought in the charity shop. Lucky bag as I keep calling it. It's where they're trying to shift a lot of their toys in one go by offering some good ones and some bad ones all in the same bag. £1.95 the bag cost me for, I think it was five or six toys. So what we have here is a train, obviously. No manufacturer's name on it, so I don't know who it's made by. But it does have three button cells in it. And it makes sound effects. And the way you operate it, there's no, there's no push button on the outside. It's the front wheels, as you push them up, they operate a switch. with a flashing LED on the front. And the speaker is in the back there. So what I'm going to do is put fresh batteries in it and take it back to the charity shop as a donation. Looks like it only needs two screws to undo the whole thing so we might take it apart just to have a look what's inside. We'll do the button cells first. LR44s I expect, that's what they usually seem to be. Yeah, LR44s, so we'll replace them. These AG13s are the same size. Poundland, for a nice big pack of them. Right, what sound are we going to get this time? So that's a bit louder, isn't it? Okay, well we'll take it apart anyway. Just have a look. Battery pack goes in there, speaker, little circuit board with a little push button on it which is activated by the axle going down. LED at the front, nice and simple. And then here we've got a little friction motor or flywheel motor. So we've got a gear on the axle, which is a sort of a green colour. Let's have a close up. Right, gear on the axle, green colour. That green one drives that orange one. Then that orange one drives that orange one. And that orange one drives that grey white one that's on the shaft of the flywheel. So we have a step up effect, a small turn on here is magnified or multiplied into multiple revolutions on the flywheel. Right, put it back together.
I think we might shut it up <laughs> while it goes back to the charity shop. <laughs> 